Hi everyone, Liam here again from Gaming on Linux. Today I'm going to give you another short tutorial. Today we're going to play some absolute classics including Morrowind, Warzone 2100 and the original XCOM which is a close personal favourite of mine. I grew up playing that on the Amiga. Now for this you go into desktop mode, open up Discover and search for something called Proton Up. QT. It's a really useful installer program that enables you to download with a couple clicks extra compatibility layers because Steam Play is just a system that uses compatibility layers like Proton but we're going to use a different one made by the community called Lux Torpeda, Lux Torpeda, something like that and you'll see it is literally a couple of clicks. It will install it for you Download it, install it, put it in the right place, and then it's basically done. Now, there is one issue with Steam. If you've already got it open, you'll see here in a moment that it doesn't actually show up. The thing is, when you install a new compatibility layer, Steam doesn't actually refresh the folder. So you'll see we'll go into the compatibility menu. We're going to force a specific Steam Play tool, and it's not actually in the list. So if you if you ever add in extras like this to Steam, you need to quit Steam and reload it. And it basically refreshes the folder it looks in for compatibility layers. So we'll give that a moment to load up. And then we're going to start with Morrowind. And all you have to do is really amazingly simple. You right click go to the properties menu, go to compatibility and select Luxtapeda. It's quite a cool name actually. I don't, I don't know what it means, but yeah. And then download it. But you can do this after you've already downloaded it as well. It's just when you go to launch, it will then download the engine that you pick. So for Morrowind, we will be using the free and open source OpenMW. This is basically a modern, complete rebuild of the game engine with loads of extra enhancements, basically. Now, once you actually pick it, what it will do is it will download the engine itself. So this is Luxtapeda doing all of the annoying work for you, and it basically sets up everything. You don't have to move files around or anything. It is so beautifully simple and OpenMW is absolutely the best way to play Morrowind. So you can see that with a couple of clicks we now have OpenMW with Morrowind working on the Steam Deck. Now a bit of a quirk here is that when you go in and you go to change the video settings the first time it doesn't quite give you the correct size in the window and you'll see we're going to go into the video menu put it into the deck resolution and then full screen. Now the good thing is a reload of that will just fix it, which is really nice. I like simple stuff. So just reload, show you it actually working on OpenMW. There we go, all working, good. Now we'll jump in, I'll show you a quick bit of it actually working and then afterwards we're going to basically do the exact same process for Warzone 2100 and at the end of the video there is a small slice of the original XCOM game which is again the same process. You just right click on the game, go to properties, compatibility and then select it from the list. It couldn't be simpler and it gives you a really great way to play these classic games on free and open source game engines or so some of the game engines that it supports aren't free and open source but the point is they're natively built for Linux and so they generally work better than the original old games running under Proton. 
Now, this one, uh, OpenMW, for example, you can see here it looks a little bit dark, but actually on the deck screen, it looks perfectly fine. And on my screen, capturing through HDMI, it looks fine. This is just a bit dark from the capture card, which is a little bit strange because other games I've tested through the capture card in the actual recording show up perfectly fine. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this and how simple it is. If you have other ideas for videos, let me know in the comments. Thank you, and I'll see you again soon.
Stand up. There you go. You were dreaming. What's your name? Well, not even last night's storm could wake you. I heard them say we've reached Morrowind. I'm sure they'll let us go. Thank you. 